Welcome to Atlanta. idea of what this may be related to if we look at his background security sensitive investigation likely the only civilian to ever achieve the position of director general of intelligence can be counterintelligence operations described as an auto intellectual some according to one report saw the guy's a little arrogant and uh his background is Big connections and understanding of East Asia and China. But, you know, sometimes these things uh, look worse than they really are on paper. 
and sometimes they're actually much more than just you know someone someone i'm being hypothetical now had access to a lot of information and a computer that weren't supposed to be on that could be boy you're spying and selling the information to another country it could also mean you took stuff home you weren't really supposed to take home because you were preparing for a meeting you know what i'm saying phil it could be something that maybe is improper but not quite as stunning as, as it could be no, you make a good point, Bill, and, you know, as you alluded to, I, you know, I work in Intel for more than 30 years in, in Canada, and, and there's no question that there's probably times you, you probably shouldn't be taking stuff home, but, you know, there's a, a deadline or you're, if something's really hot and you want to get on it, I'm, I'm not going <laughs> to tell your audience how often I may or may not have done that in my career. Um, you're not supposed to. But so you're right. I think right now we have to wait and see. But I think that the point for me, Bill, is that they, they've, been, they've made an arrest, They've laid charges, and they're going to have a conference, probably as you and I are speaking on the phone right now. I think there's a, a, a preliminary hearing. When it gets 